And today we're going to be reacting to Ra Ruby Volume 6, Chapter 5, called yeah. Feel the Move. It's called The Coming Storm. Great! How oh, great! The Coming Storm. That means the next episode is going to be really fucked up. The next episode is going to be called The Storm. Is here. <laughs> <laughs> the the, the episode storm. after that is going to be The Storm Has Left. <laughs> <laughs> the aftermath of the storm. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, what happened last time? Uh, last time, people were just kind of upset. I mean, I'm about it. I was kind of punched. I'm in upset. Quick D. I was kind of. <laughs> I was kind of got punched in the face. So did Oscar. And um, Crow was sad. He drank some more. He's gonna need an intervention. Um. Uh, what else happened? Old lady was just like, you guys should fuck up. Let's go. Head down the trail. Stop being a bunch of little moody bitches. And, uh, let's see here. Salem was upset, you know. I'm upset. That, that they failed. And, and, uh, what else happened? Uh, and then she had yeah, threw a fit. And, I mean, that was kind of it. And they went to a farm. It was abandoned. And people were probably dead. And that's it. Yeah, yeah, you are. You are extremely right. <laughs> I mean, I got nothing else more to add That's other right. than they're upset. They're upset. Fifteen thousand dollars. Uh, I don't know the song, but uh, I mean, other than that, let's just get straight on into this, let's right? Let's support the original content as, as always. always. And let's go in three, two, one. Is Gah. your boy? Is your boy? Walking down the street. That's a boy walking down the street. Saying like what episode are we on again? It's like five? Okay. Not even halfway. I was thinking like why would we not see like Adam or more of Cinder or stuff like that? Or Jean. I don't know why I like this song more than the other songs, but I just do. It, I feel like it just a little bit, like, I don't know, it, it just goes better, I feel. Yeah. Maybe that's just me. Do you have my information? Oh, Cinder, okay, I was just talking about it. Of course I do, Of course I do, darling. I'm just a southern bird. Although, I can't promise you'll be pleased. She just has a shootable face. Like, I really want to shoot her. You didn't even know her, man. That's the, the little shipyard. You know, you turned out to be quite the interesting customer. Cinder. Cinder. How do you know my name? It's not often a single client brings me double the business. 
double the business. Oh, oh, it's uh, uh, uh what's your name? Oh, 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 oh Neil, Neil, yeah, Neil, 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 Neil Palatin. Hey, what's up, girl? Hey, I missed you, boo. <laughs> Hi, boo, boo. Oh, please fight. Please fight, good. I, I want a good fight. Woo! Killer. With an umbrella. Ooh, ooh, oh, yes! Shit, damn. Don't know why you're swinging with the umbrella open. It's very ineffective. So. What is up with that nails? Why does she have a cloth? Oh, wait, that's the grim thing. Yeah. My bad. She had the cover, you know. Ooh! Oh. Oh, I like that. Okay. Come on, I want those like one hit and then quick, quick, quick. Bro, her recovery. I know, right? I'm sorry, did you just see what they were capable of? Yeah, I mean... I mean yeah, you guys have a lot, but... Bro, what? Did she just turn to glass? Yeah. Shadow, bro. You've gotten stronger. You've gotten uh, Yeah, she's only been falling for like... <laughs> how many goddamn fucking volumes now? I mean, has she gotten stronger? I don't know. I still think her fight against Yang was like 10 times better. You know what's funny? I just noticed now that the hat, I didn't say nothing, but the hat was like flying around in the fucking thing. I, I just mm -hmm. noticed that. <laughs> Little Red. Ruby. That's right. I like how she's wearing like Roman torch with his hat. A weird looking um, position. Yeah, and, uh... okay, let's talk. She's like, <laughs> she can't talk. Right. Yeah, thanks. You sign language. Get it? Fuck off. Okay. <laughs> if off. Yeah, I don't either. It's annoying. Not unfinished again. This place looks fine. Oh, wait. Dead. No, that was the back. Uh, yeah, put some clothes on. <laughs> she got a scarf. <laughs> oh, yeah. Bust the door open. Mm. I can fight Grin, but I can't open the door. Oh. Aren't you outside right now? Yeah. <laughs> Close the door on me, please. I want to be the only one outside. I saw a chimney from the outside. Maybe we could get a fire going? Nah, fam. Thanks. I'll look for some blankets. Gang, go with her. Ooh. It's Resident Evil. Everyone, we gotta split up. We gotta split up and look for supplies. It is Resident Evil. There's the mansion. No. Oh, I thought you were just gonna go with Yang. It's fucking Resident Evil, bro. I swear. Oh my God, it's the Donner Party. What is it? Oh, I know. Oh. oh! What the fuck happened? Girl, well, we got some steaks. <laughs> Why they look like, uh, oh gosh, what is it? Um, mummies, there we go. Uh -huh. Like, mummies have like skin on them. They got mummified. Close the door, will you? Good job, girl. It's the same in every house. Oh, shit. What? Bodies. Every bed in every home. 
Did somebody just suck the life out of them? Like all the state just went to sleep and never woke up. Then we're not staying here, right? No. We don't have a choice. Storm outside's only getting worse. We'd freeze to death before we made it anywhere. Well, might as well get comfortable. Yeah, fat chance. Okay then. Okay, Yang. Uh, happy if thoughts. This place wasn't abandoned, Please. It might still have supplies we could use. Thank you, hey, uh, yeah. Ruby. Huh. Maybe even a car. I'll do another sweep of the grounds. No one else goes anywhere alone. Oh, let's see. Yang and I can search the other buildings for vehicles. That's right. Maybe you should button up your jacket Whatever a little bit. It's cold. Yeah. Get some more armor. Yeah. Yang is not in the mood right now. And Ruby's going somewhere. Oh, oh Food always makes me feel better. Adorable. Just saying. Food for sure. Right. Well, don't be a show up she had. I'll tell you what. Why am I talking like that? I'm sorry. You keep that fire fed. I find us a story to read before bed. Oh, story time. Did she take off her glasses? Oh, no. No. Why'd she choose at I? Um, because it's interesting. Interesting stories. I get it. Oh, we're here. Now we can talk about our feelings. And why the f you laugh? Something tells me that's not street legal. Uh, the tractor? Ah, uh, depends. Bro, farm simulator. <laughs> Come on, we live in. I live in a farm. That's definitely what street legal. Here? Yeah. There's that well on back streets. Maybe I'm just saying they're animation. in the middle of nowhere in the yeah, uh, blizzard storm. Maybe. I'm pretty sure no one can say shit. True. Hey, are you okay? No. Yeah. I mean, no. no. There you go. But I don't know. Talk about it. I'm just tired. Oh, uh, don't be tired. Don't be tired. You know what happens when you go to sleep here. <gasps> oh, shit. Hey, I found something. A cart. A trailer. A trailer. Okay. And you can put that on the back of your bike? No. I'm sorry, what? No. What just, is it? Just, yeah. I... Weren't you just saying something about Cinder saying... and Adam? And look, there they are. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. I'm pausing it. Hold on. Hold on. What? Hold on. Let me look back. Okay. I'm right. Oh. Uh, come get, on. Can't get. There we go. Was he wearing that? Um, in volume three. Do you remember? I don't remember. I don't know. Because if he wasn't wearing that during the the battle of. Uh, the Battle of Beacon, then how does she know he looks like this right now? You know what I'm saying? Ooh. Unless he's, like, actually there. You're finding holes in the story right now, bro. I feel like, I mean... I mean, I don't remember exactly what he looks like in Volume 3, though. I don't, I don't have my phone. You want me to get my phone? Yeah, grab your phone real quick. We're going to deduce this story right now. I'm going to break this story open. A lot of text messages from work right now. Uh, here, just go ahead and take it. I'm just gonna do. Um, you know what? I need some Ruby. Ruby, oh, volume three. Adam. Find images. Oh no! Okay, never mind. I I was wrong. I I am sorry. He who was wearing that? Yeah, but how does Yang know? They didn't run into each other, did they? Yeah, that, cause that's where he, her arm got cut off. Oh oh yeah. <laughs> there. I know. Yeah, I was thinking about not the tactic beacon. I was thinking of uh. Oh shit! What did we just see? When he got whipped down. Where what was that? I can't even think of the fucking name. Leo and and uh. Oh, uh, the Battle of Haven. Yeah. What is it? What is it? I... 
Go shake it well. I was just seeing things. I'm sorry. I still get flashes from that night. Calm down. Calm down. Do you think I'm still out there? Uh, yes. Know. If you went back to the White Fang, there would have been serious consequences. But like, they died. <laughs> <laughs> That wasn't what she wanted you to see. Forget it. I can do it myself. I can run it down. How about about we'll fight together and not like, I'll protect you because last time you tried to fight him, get your arm cut off. Whatever. You're trying to be nice. Yeah, I I understand. Except for what it is. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Okay, Lumos. I am Groot. There. Wait, what? I was thinking about like Groot in the, in the Fireflies. Uh, well, I was thinking about Harry Potter, but yeah. well, that's where our minds went. Huh? I'm just not sure how well my uncle's taking all of this. Yeah, she's probably should, it. You probably should cover up the bar. Come on, we'll never get to Atlas on an empty stomach. I should be all right. Not with all this alcohol around here. I should be all right. He's a big boy. Ruby? Are we really still going to Atlas? Yeah. Why wouldn't we be? Yeah. I mean, you heard what Jen said. Yeah. If there's no way to kill Salem, then what's the point in all of this? Why is, you can't be serious. Trying to, like, delay the inevitable. Sorry, I, I don't know what I'm saying. I, I'm just really tired and I... I'm sorry, did you just say you're tired? Anything in there? Is it the second person that said that More they're alcohol. tired? More alcohol. Then at least we'll never have problems starting a fire. What's that? You right. It's a cellar. A cellar. I, I thought locked. they were already in a cellar. A cellar? Right. Even what? more alcohol. What? Okay, a little light hardness. I like it. No, trust me. You put enough salt on anything and it will taste just fine. Salt? Well, yeah. I guess it's better than nothing. Hmm. No, what's in the cellar? Why is it chained up? But I still seriously hate this place. I swear it's Resident Evil right now. Mm-hmm. Flesh! <laughs> Flesh! virus oh god where'd everybody go oh no zombies camera angle kind <laughs> <laughs> of back up <laughs> yeah okay Ooh. so um what happened not 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 much yeah not, i mean we found out that everybody there at the cult drank the punch and died <laughs> yeah. that kind of reminds me of but yeah yeah i mean like yeah nothing really happened i mean um we're i'm wondering what's in the fucking cellar man mm -hmm. what's in there what is it there's something in there because it give me an answer it, quick it, what's it, in there um it's a it's a person there's something underneath there. Because it chain straddled. Mm -hmm. And the door kind of opened. Yeah. But there's something that is making this the environment sleepy. True. Because he said everyone went to sleep, they never woke up. Now we have both Yang and Weiss saying, I'm just tired. And now they're going to eat. After I eat, I take a nap. Mm-hmm. So I'm just saying. So, I don't know. 
I don't know what's underneath there. It's a Freddy Krueger. Yeah. What if they dealt with that? Like a like a grim that attacked you in your sleep? sleep in your dreams? Oh my god. Well, I'm pretty like, sure they would get sued. <laughs> no. No? Okay. No. Just change it up. Yeah. He's he's not a janitor. Is Freddy Krueger a janitor? Oh yeah, he was, wasn't he? Yeah, yeah he, he was. was. That's right. Yeah. I just watched it recently. Ooh, but okay, let's just. It's your, <laughs> your boy waking me up the street. Okay. Wind it now, okay? Bring oh, okay, back. okay. So okay. this this scene. Okay. I like that. You were like wee wee wee. Wreck a wreck a wreck a wreck a wreck. DJ D Rick. Okay, I hate this girl. My constituents. <laughs> You're a very interesting individual sitting there. That was a horrible representation of what she said. Tits but squished together. Yeah. Uh, she was just she just had like a shootable face. I don't know what to say. Okay. And then the fight between so Neo comes out of nowhere. She's been following this whole time. She I, ch- like... I I've honestly forgotten about her. Right. It's true. I mean, we were talking about her for like until volume four. Yeah. About her still floating, but then like afterwards, you just forgot about her. Freed it. Um, and then she just shows up out of nowhere. I wonder how she communicated. If she's like a silent, sign language. Yeah, you're right. Okay, so this fight. How would you think about the fight? Great, I liked it. Mm-hmm. It was tight. You haven't seen her in a while, you know. She looks beautiful, as always. As always. Um. I don't know what it is, but I don't think this choreography still matched up to the choreography in Volume Two. Because if you if you stop and think about it, they had similar um, instances where Cinder is fighting without a weapon, mm-hmm. and Yang is technically a hand to hand combat fighter. Mm-hmm. Therefore, Neo had the same sort of type of opponent, mm-hmm. and I, I still feel like her her fight scene in Volume Two was better than this one. I'm not saying this one's bad. This one's mm-hmm. this one's probably the best we've seen in a while. Uh, you need to burp in every single yeah. action. They love it. They do. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I don't know. I when I think of Neo, I think of like a hit ice cream no oh. the matrix <laughs> like a hit <laughs> and then like quick like one two like the three parry. jab <laughs> yeah i think of like a bunch of parries and a lot of like one attack leading to a like two or three quick attacks where it just seemed like she was swinging the umbrella a lot more like a bat i guess uh, i do like the recoveries that she had yeah. She used the umbrella to kind of recover. And all in all, it was, it was a good fight. I like this yeah. part right here, where she like flew up and then shot down. I like it when she was doing like them cartwheels and then came up with her feet and she kicked her in the face. Yeah. It was good. And to be fair, if Cinder did not have the powers, I feel like Neo could beat her. Yeah. Oh, let's talk. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can't. You can't. And then we have the shot of Resident Evil right here. Yep. Number one. You know. No, I was like, a Ruby Resident Evil game. I don't know. Interesting. Have you, have you seen Dreams? Like, the I video game Dreams? Dreams every night, bro. You know, sometimes I'm flying. Sometimes I'm fighting off dragons. Mm-hmm. You know? I don't have dreams. I have nightmares. Anyways, uh, no, Dreams the video game. No. So it's a it's a video game where you can go and create your own game. Like it, it simplifies uh, coding and game design, so you're able to go create your own game, and then put it online for other people to play it, and you can go and play it and stuff like that. You got you gotta look it up. Anyways, oh, and there's this one dude I can't remember the name right now, but he's making like an Avatar: The Last Airbender game from Dreams. Freaking sick. I'm just saying, 
Like, if I had a lot of time in my hand, I would definitely make a Ruby game. I didn't know that was like, that's a thing, man. That's fucking thing. crazy. Yeah. Like, people... I can go make my own video game. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, well, I'll have to show you I'm after. I'm too old, I tell you. Anyways, it's it's great. I definitely think somebody somebody should at least make a Ruby video game off of there. And hopefully not get copyright. Mm, that'd be kind of tough. It would be tough. They would have to somehow, some way, include them into it. Yeah. Well, I mean, people have already, like, recreated, like, Mario 64 or, you know, stuff like that. Grand Theft Auto Ruby. <laughs> <laughs> Let me steal this train! <laughs> Sorry! Change the crow. I just oh, no. need a drink! Yeah. And then, it's gonna Maria. Close his door! And like, um, excuse me, It's cold! You're standing you're, outside. You're, you're in the snow. <laughs> Come on, Maria. Well, Mother, she did yeah. say the glasses weren't really working for her very well, you, you know? You're, you know what, you're right, actually. I'm not gonna hate on her too much. Well, this is straight re- out of Resident Evil right now. It is almost it? 12 o'clock. Okay. Resident Evil, bro, right here, I tell you. Oh, let me look at the pictures. Oh, somebody's screaming? Oh, there's dead people? Oh. Mm-hmm. And a mystery? I wonder why they show the picture. Is there some significance to the picture? Ah, uh, yeah. The next episode, we're gonna we're gonna find out why everyone's falling asleep. We're gonna find out who's in the cellar. We're gonna find out what the hell happened to everybody. I'm just saying, if anything about Umbrella gets brought up, <laughs> he says that it's all just red and white. This one dude just with glasses. Mm. I don't think anything shows over there. Anyways, oh no. Oh, and now Weiss has a traumatic experience. She's like, oh my god, oh, dead comfort people. you, Weiss. Oh, adorable. I'm scared. Oh. Weiss is my wife. You're not gonna save me neither! <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? What do you I, mean? I tuned you out for like two seconds oh. and then I was like, wait, what? Okay, you're just like the kids at my house now. Yeah. Uh, Crow's like, hey, blah, 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 the playing off the best friend roles right now. Mm-hmm. So these two are like best friends, yeah. and then Yang and Weiss, or not Yang and Weiss, Yang and Blake are the best friends. And then she picks I from for no reason at all. Because. Dealing through the snow. It does seem like thing like um, Red Dead Redemption 2. The beginning. Yeah, yeah, totally. I was just looking for food. This blizzard came out of nowhere! Yeah. Where's young Jimmy? <laughs> okay, uh... <coughs> that voice did not help out my throat. Okay, uh, seeing, uh, Adam. Seeing. Oh, seeing. Yeah. Seeing Adam. Like, oh, yeah, I'm yeah. so scared. Oh. Oh, yeah, I'm so scared. Yeah. <laughs> the most calmest voice ever. <laughs> <laughs> And then Blake, Blake says, you know, is trying to help, but then, you know, she says, uh, I'll be there to protect you, mm-hmm. which in Yang's eyes means that she's, she, isn't, yeah. she doesn't think she's capable of doing it or like she's weak. And, you know, you can't tell Yang that she's weak because Man, Yang won't have it. I get it. I'm just saying yeah. your, your arm got cut off. So. Yeah, it's a, it's a poor choice of words, yeah. but it's something that probably I would say. I mean, but she should have known better. I mean, like. Blake? Yeah. Mm, you should have known better not to say that. I mean, Yang's so strong and independent. I mean, to be fair, they have been separated for, like, what, nine months? Okay. But, I mean, they were roommates for how long? Yeah. But, like, her arm got cut off, but and then she left for nine months. So she doesn't really know exactly how she's dealing with the whole arm cut off thing. Your arm got cut off. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, but she doesn't know it from experience. The only thing she can do is like empathize 
You can say she knows what type of person she is. She shouldn't have said that. Yeah. Blake's always the awkward talker anyways. True. But I love her. Mm-hmm. Oh, she's so, so happy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she wasn't. <laughs> I love how I went from this and then just like, boom. What? Boom. Mm. Eh. Eh. Oh. Mm-hmm. No. Uh, no. Stop. Here. I'm still talking about it. Oh, what's going on? Lumos. Oh. Harry Potter. Rude. I'm talking about, oh, alcohol. Maybe we should cover this up so that Crow doesn't see it. What nice and caring Ruby. Yes. Caring about her uncle. But he'd then, be pissed if he found out that you kept all that booze from him. Yeah. He'd be proud. Oh, look at that. Okay. <laughs> Naruto. <laughs> Food. The cellar. I want to know what's in there. Yeah. And then the cellar starts shaking. So. God. Must be something. Well, we know. Probably found out next episode. Hopefully. Probably will. Uh, I, I don't know what will be in the cellar. It's going to be... Um... You know who's in there? It's gonna be um, Mark Hamill, Jodie Foster, and Mike Tyson. And they're gonna be knitting. <laughs> yeah, think about that for a second. <laughs> <laughs> ah! I hurt my tongue, I hurt my thumb with this needle. <laughs> Let me out! <laughs> I don't, I, I don't understand how you got that. I you know, it just, I just. It just comes to me sometimes. Yeah. I, sometimes I'm just blessed with this god given like, talent like of gift. just making things up in my head and spewing it out without the second thought. Yeah, kind of actually. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> ah, anyways, yes. that was our reaction to uh, Ruby uh, Volume 6, Chapter 5. If you liked our reactions, make sure to like and subscribe. Uh, if you guys want us to let us know any more about Ruby, put it in the comment section down below. And we will see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.